we're answering what happens to a celiac patient who eats gluten. Not good things. I repeat, not good things. With celiac disease, this is not like a gluten intolerance where, yeah, you might feel a little crappy when you have gluten and you can still have it here or there. You can absolutely not have any gluten whatsoever if you have a celiac disease. I know that sounds extreme and intense, but I promise it's actually a lot easier nowadays because there's so many different options that you can really enjoy the things that you love. But let's go back to the question. What happens when someone does eat gluten? Well, it triggers your immune system to damage your small intestine lining. And the small intestine has these villi. They kind of remind me of just things in the ocean that just like float around. I don't even know what I'm, what I'm thinking of or what I have in mind. Octopus tentacles, sure, let's think that. Anyways, there's these villi that line across your small intestine. And when you eat gluten in a celiac patient, those villi, instead of being um, finger-like projections and helping absorb all the nutrients and minerals in your body, they actually flatten. And then when they flatten, this is the issue of not being able to absorb your food and nutrition that you're actually consuming, which is not good. Also produces a lot of inflammation because your immune system, if you eat gluten and if you do it continually, this is furthering your immune system activation and it's causing a lot of inflammation, which then we all know inflammation, chronic inflammation tends to lead into other chronic diseases. So we want to make sure that as a celiac disease patient, you are not consuming any gluten at all, 0%. So we can help support your gut health for now and for a long time coming. Because you are struggling with digestive health, we want to send you something for free. We want to connect you with our first week of our gut protocol. Now this is something that will help you try to improve your digestive health by maximizing nutrient absorption and making sure that the foods you are eating, you are breaking it down. Now this is the first of many. This is just a jump start to your season. This is not something that you do for the rest of your life or for a long time. This is just the first week. I want you to do the first week, see how you feel, and then get in contact with us to move forward with your next steps. I'll leave the link in the description.